Well, here's my here's my shit myself story. <laughs> Buckle up. All right, so I'm clocking in a trim. <laughs> oh god, we're, we're riding like 300 pounds at this point. Nice. I was d- take you all the way in the way back machine to 2002. <clears throat> I am on the way to a shitty college basketball game that I did not want to go to with my girlfriend. We're riding in the back of the car with with her friends. And she's looking at me like, there is something wrong with you. Like, there is seriously something wrong with you. Yeah. And I'm like, I, I really have to go to the bathroom. I really, I really, really have to go to the bathroom. And she's like, well, can you wait till we get the same? And I'm like, I'm trying my fucking hardest so she's like what do you have to do and i lie to her and i go i just gotta pee i gotta pee really bad i had a lot of beer i gotta pee oh man so we get there and luckily there's a field right next to where we are so i run over to the creek and i'm like oh fuck fuck oh shit this is bad this is fucking bad uh, uh. and then like <laughs> but you know when you have to go to the bathroom and you know sweet release is just a few inches away yeah, you got a turtle hut everything out. in your body shuts down and just like every hole yeah. opens up and everything yeah. pops out that happened as i was pulling my pants down and it's just like <laughs> all over the place and it's like this jesus hey Christ, have you ever man. watched a cow take a shit <laughs> how it just like comes out in patty form it just kind of squirts out and lands in this gigantic like it's it's like the pile of clay they sculpted in Ghost. Yeah. <laughs> oh. This is no. like a this is like a scene from like a Happy Madison production. Or so something. I, but it's not over. So I do that, and like everyone's yelling, like Scott, where are you? Hurry up! I thought you just had to pee. I'm like, oh, I'm going as fast as I can. But I'm in the middle of the forest, and it was the <laughs> runniest, like dirtiest shit ever. And I can't wipe my ass. And I'm like, oh, fuck. You got to go in the creek. So. I, I'm like, they're, they're going, we're going, we're going, come on, get the fuck over here. And I'm like, all right, all right, shit. So I pull up my pants that still there's like dribbling and I'm walking to the stadium like with my, with my legs as wide as possible so it doesn't touch anything. And I get to the stadium and I'm like, oh shit, that, that's, that's shit in my pants. That, that was not done. And I go into the bathroom and I open up, I, I open up my, my pull down my pants in the stall and it's just, it looks like a baby's diaper, and I'm like, "How the fuck am I getting?" And this is the dirtiest stall ever. It was like the stall out of train spotting, so I can't like take off my shoes and like take off my pants and then get rid of them. So I thank God this is before. Oh, it was in 2001 because I still had a pocket knife on my on my keychain, and I could fly with that. Uh, it had the scissors on them, so I cut the underwear off of me. <laughs> I pulled my pants down, cut the underwear off of me, and instead of Jesus. being an adult and wrapping it in like the free cowboy hats they give you to put on the uh, toilet seat, I cut the underwear off and throw it in the toilet and try and flush it. <laughs> <laughs> so there is oh, like no. double XL boxer shorts filled with shit in the toilet, halfway flushed <laughs> down. I flood the toilet and I walk away and... And I just shut the stall door, and I walk in. There was a guy waiting to come in. I was like, I don't know who the fuck was in there before, but they they made a mess. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. And so I walk they- out, I meet my girlfriend. She's like, what the fuck's wrong with you? I said, we, we got to go. We gotta, I'm free balling, and uh, we we, we got to go. <laughs> so there you go, Joe. Yeah. There well, you know. Joe. No, yeah. no, one Joe. Else, no, one no one else has a story? I just, I just like – I like the – to picture when two think, hours after that when and, and the lights go down oh, and, I, I thought of that. and, and the, the, the janitor walks I in and sheds that. a single tear <laughs> <laughs> I thought of that all I, night. I saw that happen in my elementary school once we were taking like one of those shitty placement tests and some girl got like super nervous pissed herself in the middle of the test piss dripping off the chair and they brought in this guy Mr. McConville who was this old Irish guy <laughs> he was just like pretty much like the oh, guy who the, the fuck is pissing all over yeah. the floors here and he walked in looked down and started crying like <laughs> no joke no joke tears in his eyes and I just looked up at him and I was like I will never be a janitor uh, <laughs> dude yeah we used to destroy I'm gonna ele- try it this school shit a little bit elementary, <laughs> element- elementary school we used to destroy the shit out of bathrooms <laughs> <laughs> I'm talking about fireworks in the toilets, and M80s yes. in the toilets to in make them explode. Yes. In elementary in school. In elementary school. And then we used to ball up paper towels 
soak them in water and <laughs> whip them, yeah, slap them whip on the ceiling. Of the I used to wait for kids to go in and take a shit. They were like a big ball of paper yes. towels and slam dunk them. I we used to call them slam dunking. Yeah, just yeah. run up on a kid. He's like taking a towel. Like, <laughs> what? <laughs> Yeah. I went to Catholic school and we had we had like a row of urinals and then there was the drain that every bathroom had oh. and every kid would fucking line up and all pee into the drain instead of the urinal right <laughs> next to always- so they would just piss on the floor because it was funny because we would all try and get it it was like shooting the shooting the fucking bomb into the Death Star for us oh, just peeing into this I remember I was hole. I was telling my ex girlfriend during in high school about like th- this type of stories and she's like you think that's bad and I'm like oh, what no. could possibly oh, be going on. Oh, no. girls room. And then she's like, check this out. And I sneak into the girl's bathroom, and there's like just three of the no. most miserable, no. <laughs> no. bloody, no. <laughs> no. disgusting. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> Just stop. We get it. We get it. Like Stuck to the wall. <laughs> like they're, they're taking them out. Stop. And then stop. flinging them stop. around the room. And, and then underneath it, it always says, like, blank is a whore, and here's her number. And you're like, damn, <laughs> these girls are dirty. Yeah. Damn. Oh, man. There was always that kid in elementary school that didn't figure out at the stop. urinal to keep your fucking pants up and Oh, right. Under- the they, oh, yeah. What was he called? Oh, yeah. He was uh, yeah. the retarded kid, I think, was his name. Well, this kid was British that did it in my <laughs> under- he, was just Brit- he was, like, really British and just didn't know. He was, like, fish out of water. So, <laughs> Are you writing this down? <laughs> yeah, there's nothing wrong with Velcro sneakers, okay? <laughs> um, wow, we should just stop soon. <laughs> Trying to get timestamps of the shit I have to cut out. <laughs> what are you cutting? What are you? Are you what just cutting out the, the? Oh no! The rodeo. Ryan has slowly but surely just turned into like uh, the the sad dad over there. Yeah, he was freaking out. Was what it happened? because we pissed in a hole? Was it because <laughs> that kid pulled his pants all the way down? That's fine. Ah. <laughs> uh. Was it yeah. because of the tampons? <laughs> <laughs>